I had a dream the other night. It was Vin Diesel, Jason Statham, and Thomas Jefferson. And they came to me and they said, Mike, what you and Frank do is doing wonders for the world. And that has kind of kept me going, you know. When, when we have off days, when we're not getting along, when maybe I see a movie and I don't have any ideas for what I would have done if I was in it, I think to myself, well, Vin Diesel said I'm making a difference in my dream. And that is what dreaming's all about. How you doing? I'm Frank. I'm Mike. And welcome to the documentary on If I Was In It. Basically, this is a little peek behind the scenes. Uh, we thought it'd be kind of cool to give the fans a taste of what we do. Here we are, this is where the magic happens. This is where it all goes down. This is where we are in it. This is almost like if an auto mechanic was showing you his garage, you uh, know? Or Shakespeare's writing room. Or uh, Michael Jordan's private basketball studio. Or Nicolas Cage's mirror. You know, when it comes to the show, when it comes to art, Frank is all I need. Mike's all I need. We only need each other. Well, I, and Simon. My name is Simon Powell, and uh, I work at the Children's Hospital around the block. So what is this for? He sits in the background, and uh, he, I think he really adds something. This is all for Mike and Frank, those guys? That's what this is all for? How many people could possibly think that, that the show that they're making is worth making? Here's what I like to do. I like to exercise, I like to jog, I like to work out, and I like to ride the cruise ships. Now this is nice, huh? Now this, this is a cruise ship. Frank and I like to take the cruise ship back and forth and talk about life and talk about Movies. Movies. I try to come out here two or three times a day. Staten Island Ferry. Well, yeah, but... People say, Frank, where are you going? I said, I'm going to the ferry. And they say, what are you doing there all day? I say, shut the hell up, get out of my face. I need my time on my boat. Does a yogi meditate to go somewhere? No, you, you, take, you take the ferry to take the ferry. Staten Island means everything to me. This is the greatest place on earth. This is a modern day Rome. And I love it here and I never want to leave. There's not a day or an hour or a minute that goes by when I don't think, oh my God, Staten Island. I mean, I've been here my whole life since I moved here five years ago from Massachusetts. This corner is so important to me. This is where I bought my first DVD from. It was right on this corner out of the back of a guy's van. It was a DVD, Blue Streak with Martin Lawrence. Best purchase of my life. Sort of uh, started my whole love of cinema. This very spot right here is where I decided that I needed to devote my life to movies. I was out here, I'd just gotten in a fight with my grandma. I came out here and I looked over there and I saw that. And I took one look at it, I'd never seen it before, and I thought to myself, somebody should make a movie about that. Isn't now- that, Isn't that New York City? Yes. They have a lot of movies about New York City, you know? Home Alone 2. Can't think of any others right okay, now. Okay, well, it doesn't matter what they've done. I'm talking about me. Mike's my best friend, my confidant. Uh, he's also kind of an asshole sometimes, but uh, I love the guy. He's a good guy overall, you know? Would I take a bullet for Mike? No. Uh, I'd take a punch. You're on their show a lot. You're in you keep telling me I'm on this show and I don't... Okay, excuse me, I'm sorry, but you keep telling me I'm on this show. I, I feel like you guys are a part of this and I don't want to be a part of this. I never signed anything. You guys cut me out of this. We are breaking down walls, left, right, and center. We're sort of like a... I don't know, like a civil rights or something. We're doing amazing things for art. We are changing the movie industry one movie at a time, and I will not rest until our names are printed on the Hollywood sign. We both know and appreciate film for what it is, uh, which is movies. Film is movies, and we get that. So what's your relationship like to uh, Mike and Frank? Mike and Frank who? You guys post If I Was In It. I don't know what that is. Yeah, I think the show is good for me. I think it's good for Frank. I think it's good for Staten Island. I think it's good for America. I think it's probably good for overseas. This is what Frank and I want to change about the world. You don't need to learn nothing from nobody. All you need to do is do your thing. So for us, our thing is watching movies and talking about what we would have done if we was in them.